So, okay, so how do you spot bargains, okay? How do you spot bargains? Everybody's looking for the lowest priced property. They're like, oh, you know, it's, uh, we're looking at this particular building. Everything's uh, selling for 700,000. Oh, this one came up for 680. It must be a bargain, it must be a bargain. And they think that's how you should shop for bargains. Uh, so I was talking to uh, the, those like veteran real estate investors, and this is how they shop for bargains. They just do this, offer, 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 everywhere, offer, on everything. And on, like, on every property they see, like just tons, like multiple offers everywhere. And now it's like, why do you guys do that? Because they said to me, it's not in, uh, they, they don't mind paying um, more than what it's asking if the terms are okay. So what, what does that mean? So like, oh, your property's worth 500,000. I'll give you 550 for it, but you give me a, a vendor take back mortgage, meaning you give me a mortgage for 25 years and you give me 0% interest. <laughs> or something like that, you know, something crazy like that. But it's, 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 and then they calculate, oh, how much would interest cost and that kind of thing. And veteran real estate investors are really creative. And they, they use these kind of tips and strategies that uh, work in their best interests. So uh, a little bit about thinking about outside of the box, but the key, one of the main keys to getting a great bargain, just make a ton of offers. Don't worry if it's overpriced, don't worry if it's well-priced, don't worry if it's underpriced, just make a bunch of offers. Uh, 